and welcome to Vlogmas Day 15. Is it the 15th day? I really should check the calendar before I start these things. Yes, it's the 15th. Oh my god, 10 days until Christmas Day. How exciting. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. Um, I'm just going to go downstairs, sort the kids' breakfast out, and yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, but it's nearly 10 o'clock. We've all been awake for about an hour, all just chilling in mummy's bed. Um, and yeah, Lexi is putting her head in my order box because I have sweets in there. So she's forever wanting the sweets out of my order box. Um, I have a massive pile of clothes here that I need to sort out and put into vacuum bags and things like that. I started doing it yesterday, but then I got interrupted because the platform came uh, to come and sort our heating out. And he was here for about two hours and then Kieran got home from work. There was dinner, there was sorting the kids out and then I had a shower and by the time of that it was just too late. So I have all of that to do today. I am talking really fast. I'm really loud. Um, careful. <coughs> Excuse me. Also have the kids' clothes put away, and I've also got another washing basket to sort out as well. Oh my god! Um, so yeah, we're just gonna clean. I'm just gonna clean the house right today. I'm not too sure what I'm gonna do. Um, just I don't know. Uh, what I do need to do is actually make a Christmas list on people that we've still got need to get ready for tomorrow. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it. So I'm gonna see you downstairs. Feeding William his breakfast now while watching me fall in the background. Um, so, yeah. at the minute has got an obsession of having this in here and listening to tweeny songs however i tried to put the tweenies on for it i just didn't want to listen to it all right watch it all right we can run around together best friends forever best friend oh wrong sort of bit but yeah, she's got a massive obsession of listening to the tweeners at the moment and dancing along to it. Haven't you? Yeah. So, um, I'm going to go put William down for a nap in a moment and then get on with my Christmas list um, that he's doing before we go shopping tomorrow. Uh, I also need to go and have a look what we can have for dinner tonight as well. Because um, I don't really know what to do. But yeah, that's about it, really. Both kids have gone down for a nap, so I'm going to sit and do my Christmas list. Um, and then edit last night's video, ready to go up tonight. Um, so yeah, let's see how much we've still got to get. Hopefully we don't have to get too much. And hopefully we won't be bankrupt tomorrow. So yeah, hopefully A is okay. <laughs>
you think that your Christmas list is finished with when actually it's nowhere near hang on a moment as I was saying um yeah I thought I was near enough done with Christmas but turns out I'm actually not I'm still got a big old list for people to buy for um that is included me and Kieran um so yeah don't ever stress about Christmas. Don't always feel like you have to go over the top either. Like some people from us have probably got like a gift that's like five pound. Um, but obviously the price doesn't matter. The quantity doesn't matter. The only thing that matters is obviously the giving. Um, because we all love to give presents. I love giving presents. I love spoiling the kids. I, love, I just love people watching and opening presents and stuff like that. Um, but this year, like I think majority of us all know that this year is more for family and friends just to actually see each other because we've gone near enough a year without seeing our family or friends like properly um so yeah that that's that's what this year's all about isn't it so yeah need to have a look on the web see what i can get on the web um and see what i can get cheaper on the web and things like that um so if we use amazon argos um or anything really and then seeing what I can get tomorrow as well while we're out. Um, the thing is, is I, don't, I don't want to rely all on tomorrow because we don't know what's going to be happening with William. We don't know how long we're going to be in hospital for William with William for. We don't know if it's going to be an appointment that he's going to just be like, all oh, right, okay, so this is this and we need to bring him back for this. Or if it's going to be like, a, oh, okay, so here you go, here's this and then that's it, we're done. Or if it's going to be, a, okay, we're going to keep him in for a little bit and see how he is. Um... We don't know what's going to happen tomorrow, so t tomorrow is playing it by ear. But all, all, all's well. We're, we'll be, like I say, we'll be going Christmas shopping afterwards. Um, why we are already out? Um, that way we don't have to come home and then go back out again. Um, because normally we go to Meadow Hall for Christmas shopping, but obviously due to coronavirus, we cannot do that. Um, so yeah. This is what's happening. So I'm going to go on the web, see what I can find, and write a list and things on see what I can get people. Because, yeah, that would be grand. I also need to ring up my cousin because he has sent over um, the kids' Christmas presents. Um, like, obviously, he's ordered them from the likes of Amazon and then just brought them straight over to my house and I can wrap them because they live in Essex. Um, and obviously, because of the coronavirus, we can't see each other to gift our presents as we would do normally. Um, so he just asked me to wrap everyone's up this end. So I wrap, I wrap my brothers up, I wrap the kids up, I wrap my nephews up for them. Um, and he sent two, two Elsa dolls. Um, and so I didn't know whether or not one of them was meant to be Arna. So I need to wait for him to ring me to ask him. Um, so that way I can ring up Amazon or if he can ring up Amazon and say, oh, there's been a bit, bit, bit of a mix up. Um. If not, I'll give him the money for it and I will gift it to somebody. Um, so, yeah, that's what happened there. Well, we shall see. But anyway, I'm going to crack on with this while the kids are quite happily playing and doing whatever. From the shop, we're on a bit of a late lunch, like it's 10 to 3, and Lex is having a lunchable, but with Kieran finishing work and I'm doing it about half past five I'd rather just munch out on something and then we'll have dinner later on um when he finishes work about six so she always gets a bit thingy at this time um I need to find out what to have for dinner tonight because I have no idea what to even do um I might do the kids fish fingers I mean curry jacket potatoes actually um just because we need an early night tonight the kids need to be in the bath um like I said we've got a very really start early start tomorrow morning um William's got the hospital at 10 so Alexis has got a nursery at eight so early start um so yeah excuse me one second oh i just had the biggest coffee in there oh i'm okay i think so they love it when things like this are on discounts so these were 90 pieces of one pound 80 uh, just because they've got tomorrow's date on them so i picked up both packets that were left because you know i'll put one in lexi's lunchbox and i'll probably have one now kieran will probably have one now lexi'll have one now so yeah, they've only got tomorrow's day on them, like, and it's only a best before as well, so, what's the point? Um, and then also, Kira's favourite drink was on offer as well, so it was only a pound, so I just picked that up as well, just a little mini shopping haul. And I got some bread, 
I did go out for a run essential. I got some bread and I did get some fruit and some ham and stuff for Lexi's pack lunch tomorrow. Um, just because we've not had a chance to go shopping yet because payday was only today. So we'll probably go food shopping while we are out tomorrow. Anyway, enough rambling on and that. I'm going to make myself a drink, sit down. And uh, yeah, that's about it really. Someone else who like is a council tenant will pr like probably be able to preach for me on this one. So like whenever you get somebody moving into a new house on your estate, you always get a bit weary. Just because we're like in a, such a small little cul-de-sac outside. Um, Everyone on here near, near enough owns their house now. They've bought them from the council. Um, and all of them are like probably between the ages of like 30 and upwards. Um, me and the Ki me and Kieran are actually the, like the youngest people on this street, and we're twenty three and twenty four. Um, there's nobody younger, um, and it's a really quiet um, estate. And you would literally think that we wasn't due and like even part of the council. Like I say, majority of the people here now actually own their houses from the council. Anyway, they're clearing out um, number twelve at the moment, and I'm really, really, really scared because like like I've said. We have no issues on this council estate whatsoever. There are no druggies, um, no no one that has the police there like all the time, and it's just a really nice place. And everyone gets on with ev like everybody, um, and we're like, yeah, we just all talk to each other. We're all selling Christmas cards and things like that, and like we're just all friendly with one another. And I just don't want someone coming in and ruining that. Like, I'm like, I'm like really scared. I always get scared when one of the houses get available, but we've always been lucky. In the fact of it's always been somebody that's like really nice um and they have like no issue whatsoever um so yeah <clears throat> that's great um but it's also really nerve-wracking as well um like everybody who comes on here wouldn't actually think we was a council estate just because of how well um kept these houses are and how like tidy it is outside um and yeah you, you just wouldn't think it when you walk like when you came on the street you'd literally just think it was just like a normal little close um, but yeah. Just sort of hoping and praying that it's someone decent. Fingers crossed though. Anybody else have a really unhealthy obsession with crisps? Oh. Mine's skips. I feel like two bags of skips. I have to have two bags of skips because one bag just doesn't satisfy me enough. So I have to always get a grab bag of skips. I'm gonna have skips. Just come off that. Um, <coughs> that's the one thing that when we diet next year that I'm really going to miss and I'm going to have to have like every Saturday for treat night because yeah after Christmas and after the new year we're knuckling down and having a diet because we're both getting a little bit on the side so Lexi just fell off the chair while she was eating her dinner. Didn't you? Yeah. You hurt your head. Mummy kissed it better though, didn't she? Yeah. We're now watching the Santa Claus, which Lexi is mesmerised by. Do you like this film? Yeah. Yeah, is it Santa? Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, we're gonna sit and watch Santa Claus and we're still carry on Christmas shopping, which I've not actually done yet. Um, and yeah, that's about it really. And oh yeah, I've got to wait for my cousin to call me. Um, oh yeah, I told you this already, didn't I? Yeah. Excuse me. So yeah, so that's the plan. Just making the kids and me some dinner. Oh, okay, when I say the kids and me, I'm making us all dinner. Um, and Lexi's just sat here putting shoes on and on the wrong foot. The things that they do. Also, every single freaking day now, all I get, I, I think I said this earlier, is this on and Christmas music. All the time. It's all I have to listen to from like 4pm is Christmas music. So, uh, yeah. Um, I think I might break out the secret to Kira. Although, I don't see why he's not seen the fact that I vlog. Um, but, if we can here. I think I might break out the secret with Kieran tonight, just so I can bring you along shopping with me tomorrow. Um, Cause yeah, it'd be really nice to sort of just do an out and about vlog. But who knows? Who knows? We'll do whatever. I'll try. 
I don't know why I was so nervous. I watch couples vlog all the time, and I think it's because obviously they decide and to, like together that they're gonna vlog, and I'm just there like, mm, I don't have the confidence. But I would really love to, because then I wouldn't like be so shy into like, I don't know. <coughs> Who knows? Um, but yeah. But yeah, we'll see what's what. We'll do whatever. Even if I don't speak tomorrow, I'll still do some sort of like montage vlog tomorrow. I'm sure I will. Um, but yeah, while dinner's cooking, I need to actually edit the last night's video because I've not yet done it. Um, and if I do it like I did last night, yesterday, it'll take me until like 10 p.m. to actually upload the video. So I'm gonna crack on, edit yesterday's video, get that up. Um, and then I'm going to do the dinner, like obviously do dinner, get the kids sorted, ready for bed, ready for nursery tomorrow, like every- No, no, you don't need no, no. So yeah, um, I can't remember what I was going to say now. Um, I can't remember what I was going to say, I was going to say something. Um, what was I saying? I've forgotten what I was saying. Ugh. It can't be that important. But I'm going to have to stop now and record and uh, watch the recording back quickly so I remember what I was saying. That's what I was going to say, just sort of get everything prepped tonight so that way we're not rushing around in the morning. Uh, so we do Lexi's pack lunch tonight. Uh, yeah, pretty much do everything tonight. And yeah, that's a little bit of it about it. So I'm going to stop now, vlog, uh, edit, put my, get my vlog up, do dinner and I'll come back to you later um, with whatever. Not too sure. We shall see. I've just done a really stupid thing. So I'm having a really weird dinner tonight. Um, just because I'm not that like, hungry. Um, with having a bit of a late lunch. Um, and my chicken bake that I'm having takes half an hour. And I've only just put it in because I thought it only took like 15 minutes. I just put it at the same time as what I put Kieran's pies in. Oh my god. How annoying. So now I'm going to have to be waiting like longer for my dinner. And I'm not even putting anything in with them oh, I've not yet. I need to put some other bits in with them oh, I'm getting so stupid God's sake I've not done this well whatsoever panic over I've just watched some sweet potato fries and we're all good aren't we I go there school tomorrow um, you're going to school all day tomorrow yeah yeah are you going to school from 8 a.m. till 6 p.m. That is an egg, yeah. Egg house. It is an egg house. What did you do with the last egg that was in the egg, ha egg house? What did you do to it? Crab. Pardon? Crab. Crab? Yeah. Crab? Yeah, crab. No, what did you do to the last egg in the egg house? Uh. What did you do to it? I broke it. You did break it. <laughs> what one? Yeah, so let's see broke the egg in the egg house. Where's Mama's egg? Well, we don't want to break another one, do we? Alexa's been in the wars today. She fell off the chair at lunchtime, didn't you? I think I told you this already. Um, and then when I was on the phone to my cousin, um, she fell off the step that she stood on now. <laughs> it, 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 I shouldn't laugh, I know I shouldn't. But it collapsed from underneath her. She just sort of just went. Um, but yeah. You've been in the wars today, haven't you? Just falling off of things. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. You're so funny, Lex. Are you funny? Ouch. 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 So, yeah, I spoke about my cousin, and basically, the two Elsa dolls wasn't meant to happen. His girlfriend um, ordered two by mistake. But it's okay, we'll have a spare one. I did offer him the money back for it, and so I could, like, either gift it onto somebody or, like I say, keep it as a spare for Lex. Um. <laughs> Say, um, either keep it um, for Lex as a spare or like give him the money back and that way I could give it on to somebody else but he said no so why is my child going get behind me <laughs> what is she doing Strange one.
I'm sure he is. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> William's got this thing now as well where I bet he's gonna stop now and video. Oh yeah, he is. He goes on to like all his fours. Now like um like using his feet. Um instead of like crawling. Yeah. So, oh my god, he was so funny earlier. I wish I managed to get my phone quick enough to record him, but I didn't. I wasn't quite that quick. Um, <clears throat> he fell asleep in his high chair um, while obviously he was having his lunch. I really should remember to keep my phones off of loud while I am uh, recording. There we go, just because it makes the noise while I'm while even though the video is going. Um, yeah, so William fell asleep in his high chair earlier, just after lunch, um, and he fell asleep while some bread was hanging out of his mouth. Um, so I ended up waking him up, getting it out of his mouth and stuff, and sort of getting him out of his high chair and stuff like that. Um, so he's not been to sleep at all today, so he's absolutely cream cracker probably, and I bet he won't be able to keep his eyes open for much longer. Um, I don't even know how he's still going. Come here, you. Oh my goodness me, you're so adorable, you're so adorable, I am, I am, oh, 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 you're right to me, oh, yeah, 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 so yeah, He's not been to sleep, so hopefully we get a good night with him. Hopefully we get a good night with Lexi tonight because she hasn't had a danger night tonight, like today. Um, but yeah, if not, I feel sorry for nursery tomorrow. I might have to tell nursery to put her down for a nap tomorrow. Otherwise, she might be a bit of a pain for them tomorrow if I don't tell her to put her down for a nap. But who knows? Um, but yeah, I hope Kira gets home soon. He got home yesterday at 22 six and this was be and this was even when he had to um go to like morrison's and stuff to go pick up william's like prescription and um, for his milk so i'm hoping that he'll be home any minute now because he doesn't have to go anywhere after work um i'm hoping that because of dinner and i definitely need to double check my chicken bake They bake in 30 minutes. My is not going to be ready till quarter to six anyway. Which is hella annoying. Oh, I can see lights. This is him now. Is it him? Oh. Is it him? It's either him and someone's parked in our space, or it's not him, so either way I'm going to go. To get into end vlogs at the moment, so I hope you had a great vlogmas yesterday, and yeah, I'll speak to you soon. Bye guys!